I'm here with Isabel Smith, who is a wedding planner, designer, and consultant to the wedding industry. And today, Isabel has graciously um, agreed to do a mock wedding consultation with us so that we can show you not exactly how it should be done, but how Isabel does it so that it gives you an idea of how an experienced planner would conduct a consultation with a bride. So I'm going to play the bride. Isabel obviously is going to play the wedding planner and we will stop at points during this video to explain why we're doing what we're doing and also to cut certain areas short because if we did a full consultation, well, Isabel informed me that her consultations take around 90 minutes and we don't wanna be on camera for 90 minutes. <laughs> we are, however, going to split this into three different videos. So it will be a three-step process, starting off with getting the bride to talk all about herself. So we are now going to assume our characters of bride and wedding planner. Enjoy, over to you. Kylie, how are you today? I'm great, thank you, Isabel. Thank you so much for coming to meet me. It's oh, no so problem. exciting to be here I and know. talk to you about your wedding. I am excited. Oh, I'm so pleased. Tell me everything. Where did you meet? How did you get engaged? Oh, um, well, we actually met um, whilst I was on holiday in Australia, so it's a bit of a holiday romance. <gasps> they never last. This is amazing. Well done, oh, you. Well, I'm really hoping to prove you wrong. Absolutely. <laughs> um, but yes, I met my fiancé in Australia, in Queensland, in Brisbane, whilst oh. I was visiting friends. Um, and within three months of me coming home, my fiancé saved up the money to come and live with me here in the UK oh, so we wow. could spend time together. And two years down the line, we are now getting married. Oh, this is so exciting. What a lovely story. So tell me, how did you get engaged? Was it very romantic? Was it down on one knee? Um, it was romantic. It was quite low key because I didn't want to be put too much in the spotlight. <laughs> so um, we went to my favorite restaurant um, oh. and he did get down on one knee and there was a violinist playing, but that's because I play the violin, so. Oh, good boy. Boy done yes. good. Oh, there was well a big done. tick in the box. Yeah, <laughs> good. Oh, that's fantastic. So you've not been engaged all that long. No. Um, which is super exciting. So you're literally at the early stages now. Very. Figuring yes. out We've done what nothing. Want. Okay. No problem at all. That's what I'm here to help you with. Um, so obviously before today we had a brief chat on the phone. So I just want to check that your thinking is still roughly along the lines of what, what we discussed sure. when we spoke. Um, so you're, you and your husband both, or fiancé I should say, both husband live, to be. husband <laughs> to be, both live here in the UK. We do, yes. Um, and you're looking to get married here in the UK followed by, legally, followed by a destination wedding with your friends and family in Italy, is that right? Yes, that's right. Wonderful, very, very romantic. Yeah, oh. we're pretty excited. Good. I love Italy. It's a, such a romantic country amazing food and wine it's it's, a, it's gonna be a really good fit for a pretty awesome day that's what we were thinking <laughs> fantastic so we had said that um you're gonna have about 50 guests roughly is yes. that still the case yes brilliant no children no we decided on a no children rule mm -hmm. but we might need some help with how we implement that not uncommon yes there's always yeah. a uh, i don't want to upset anybody no um but really from a budgetary point of view and just for our enjoyment of the day yeah we don't really want to be worried about having children running around and sure. crying in the speeches and all <laughs> yes. the rest of it so yeah. we just decided a, a, a blanket no yeah fantastic well there's nothing wrong with a child-free wedding um a lot of mums and dads actually quite like leaving their kids with their parents or in-laws so that they can have a weekend off to you know to go <laughs> yeah, and have a laugh i think a few of our friends and family will be quite relieved <laughs> fantastic 